Have you heard about Spotify's new AI DJ? When I opened Spotify earlier in the week, uh, there was some kind of notice that came up or an alert saying like, oh, Spotify has a new DJ, check it out. Anytime something new pops up on these kind of apps, I typically will click onto it because I'm curious. I want to see what it's about, see if I like the feature. And it was so interesting because when I opened this DJ, I was immediately taken aback because the DJ spoke to me, Grace, directly. It caught me off guard and really surprised me, like the whole concept of this DJ, that I tried to um, screen record it as soon as I could so I could share with you guys as an example. Hey, what's happening, Grace? I'm your DJ X. So I'm going to be here every day playing those artists you got in rotation, going back into your history for songs you used to love. And I'm always on the lookout for new stuff, too, just to push your boundaries a little bit. I'm going to come back every few songs to change up the vibe. All right, enough talk. I mentioned Brandy Carlisle. Let's get it going with that and some other artists in that zone. So I think the most interesting thing about this DJ is that it has personality using AI, even in the world of music, isn't new. You know, we've been, we've had Alexa around for a long time. Hey Google, Siri, that kind of thing. But the difference is it feels like the, the DJ has a personality and there's definitely throwing it back to the character of radio DJs, which is interesting because radio, I'm not sure that people are listening to radio as much as they used to. I still like to listen to it in the car whenever I can. Um, but the radio DJ has always been a cool thing. It takes a very special kind of person to be able to be an entertaining radio DJ. And so hearing that DJ personality on Spotify is totally throwing it back and is going to invoke feelings of nostalgia in people and familiarity. So I think it's going to be pretty popular. But the interesting thing even with the personality is you'll be listening to this DJ and he'll play you like a set, you know, so he'll go into some kind of theme. For example, like the music you've been listening to lately, he might play you four songs and then at the end he'll come on and be like, rounding out the set was Brandy Carlisle. What did you think about that, Grace? Next up, we're going to play it back to the most popular songs you were listening to in 2018. Kicking things off, who would I be listening to? Is Fleet Foxes. Whereas if you were to say, Hey Alexa, play me some Britney Spears. Alexa will respond with playing Britney Spears. It's just not the same. The other interesting thing too, or like the cool feature is that the DJ will sometimes provide context or like little tidbits of history, which is really fun. That's something that you would get from a typical radio DJ. So he'll come in and say, this was the, you know, we're gonna listen to some songs from 2018 and these are the things that were happening in the world at that time to try to tie in some of your memories and nostalgia with the set as well. Spotify using AI is nothing new either. They've been doing those Discover Weekly playlists for, I don't know, since the beginning, which is essentially just they're taking the stuff that you're listening to and then compiling songs that they think you'll be interested in based on your listening habits and behaviors in the past. And then of course, there's also like the um, year-end roundups that they do that everyone like just loves whenever there's like their Spotify wrapped comes up. This isn't like a wildly new thing, um, but it's interesting because everyone's talking so much about AI right now, artificial intelligence. And I think Spotify has really nailed it by using artificial intelligence, but giving it a bit of personality to have like that humanity sort of feeling and also nostalgia. Let me know if you've tried it out yet and what you think.